Yo, what's up? Yo, what's up? Welcome back to King's channel. Today, I'm with Jesse again, and we are going to discuss another pretty serious questions, which is, um, what do you think about the coming New Year? Um, what do we do usually in Taiwan uh, for New Year? Would you like to maybe explain your experience of having a ex New Year in Taiwan? Um, for my experience, I usually stay at home and watch the like a live show on TV. Mm -hmm. Um, because we have like a really famous building called Taipei 101 yes. and they will have the concert and they will have the fireworks show uh, at the like a last few seconds uh, mm. when it get closer to the new year so I was just yeah sitting in front of the TV and then watch it because it's really crowded if you go to like the place near Taipei 101 yes. so if it's just so crowded you cannot say it clearly so why not just stay at home and watch TV uh -huh. yeah that that's what me and my family usually do during the during New Year yeah. mm -hmm. and I remember when I was younger um, when mm -hmm. we would do some sort of like a really stupid things that we will have a piece of paper and then we write a nian on it uh -huh. and then you just put it on the floor mm -hmm. and then when it gets to like maybe, uh, it doesn't matter when but you just like kind of like cross uh -huh. over it and then you you say you are kua nian that that means you you are, you are you know getting through another that, year uh -huh. okay. in chinese and it also means step forward oh. over a a year. Over this year, yeah. yeah. Then you move on to the next year. Yeah, this yeah. is what uh, I, I I think I've done it once, and then right after that, I just feel like it's kind of stupid. But do you feel really empty after yeah, you sure. really like cross over the year? Yeah, <laughs> just yeah. cross over the page. Yeah. And I think as my age goes, you know, I don't really anticipate. No, anticipate. Participate. <laughs> I don't usually participate in like such a, you know, should be an exciting events every year that people just you know trying to stay up late until they get through like twelve uh, o'clock mm -hmm. at night, and then they will watch some live show just like what Jesse said, and uh, yeah, it's usually every year we will have a firework in a lot of different buildings, not only in Taipei. But Taipei 101 is pretty, pretty, you know, pretty, you know, it's, it's like a symbol of Taiwan's new year. Usually uh -huh. we, sometimes we will show some words after the firework on the building of Taipei 101. And uh, a lot of my uh, singers, they will have a show on, uh, you know, besides Taipei 101, I guess. It's mm -hmm. like a Taipei city. Hall? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, usually that's the place that they will have a concert. A lot of people are pretty crowded. I don't think I've ever been there. I've never been there. Yeah, I'm yeah. not like I'm not like a crowdy person. I don't like to be mm -hmm. in you know, get into that sort of uh, but for chaos. Me, I only care about if if I like a like I walk I walk so hard to get into like the center of the the, the show mm -hmm. get closer to the singer but somehow I just want to pee oh. then how can I like it that's like, too bad yeah so it's too crowded to oh. to to join that so make sure you pee before you get into that crowded <laughs> yeah. area mm -hmm. and then uh, yeah and then I guess nowadays if I'm really curious about what's the fireworks show I'll just like sit in front of a laptop and just uh, watch the YouTube they usually will have a live show on mm -hmm. YouTube yeah. so yeah yeah but like uh, as I get older I, I guess I'll just go to bed before 10 o'clock <laughs> <laughs> I don't even care about whether they are having an exciting show and uh, that's basically how I yeah. I treat it as a normal day just like my birthday 
Uh, I don't uh, celebrate my birthday anymore. But but like if people would like to say happy birthday to me, then that's right. fine. Mm-hmm. And just for you guys know that my birthday is coming. <laughs> Why you, you need like, to tell you like to everyone? Say, you send me a gift. You can here is an address. Probably okay. you can see it because we are not doing any edited, so <laughs> it's fine. You can just send me an email <laughs> to get your me address. Happy birthday! <laughs> happy birthday. Yeah. Yes, mm-hmm. and that's uh, that's that's it. Any other activity where we particularly will do in New York? New Year? New York. <laughs> see, did I just say New York? Yeah. <laughs> New Year. Yeah. No, but, nothing but special. About right? like the the crossover. Like I mean, cross possible. over the the year. Yeah. I mean, it's not only during New Year, also our Lunar New Year. Remember in the Lunar New Year, you mean like maybe two months? The last day, Lunar New Year. Lunar New Should Year. Chinese New Year. Chinese New Year is it's not the same day as the New I Year. Yeah, it, it's the it's not the same day, but I means um uh, when we were young, uh like like we stay, we stayed up late. Until like uh maybe like two really? two a.m. or something. In Lunar New Year, yeah. you stay up late the, because Wait, we call how? it Shou Sui. Oh, if you can shoot. stay awake, it's like um you help your like your parents, your grandparents to how to say that expand their life or oh, something. Really? Yeah. Oh, I thought Shou Sui means like you are protecting your age. Really. I thought it's for no, it's just literally for elongate meaning. the oh, age. Okay. It's especially for for your like uh, parents or grandparents oh. who are older than you. Yeah, yeah. Which is pretty weird because from a uh, like a uh, health physical view to point of view, you shouldn't stay stay up late for your to keep your parents more healthy. No. So so your parents or your grandparents they are already sleeping. Only like their like kids, their grandsons, their granddaughter stayed up late. And not all, oh. not everyone. So all you, people you can just go like to sleep to protect them like in case there are some monster coming in from your house. So I will like, just yeah. definitely protect oh, okay. you. I can do that. It's yeah. like a okay. It's like a like a house guard that you uh, just see yeah, outside of the of, house. Kind of. Yeah, oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, and usually we just watch we would just watch a TV and then play, play some poker. Silly games. Yeah, yeah, something like that. And it's oh, some I'm so <laughs> oh. yeah. Actually, you are just having fun. Yeah, and okay. then you say, oh, I'm so sorry. And, but and it's actually okay because um, at that type of age, we don't really care about sleeping that much. We just want mm-hmm. to have fun. And then even though it's in the yeah. middle of night, we don't really care. We just want to. Always seems to be so active, yeah. full of energy, and mm-hmm. we just want to play around. Mm-hmm. Yeah, which is yeah. pretty cool. But now we're old. We're getting old. Yeah, so we're getting pretty so old. So we need to like take care of our own health. Yeah. And then, and then I remember during the new lunar new years, I was always expecting to receive a red envelope. <laughs> But as you grow older, it's your turn to, to give. Give red others, yeah. other siblings or other relatives your red envelopes, yeah, which yeah. is pretty annoying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when when we we're young, it's like a, a runner new year. It's the time for you to get more money, but now yeah. it's the time for you to 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 pay to to spend yeah. more money. Eventually, yeah, just, yeah, yeah, same thing. Yeah, yeah. But luckily, the children in Taiwan is getting less and less. <laughs> Which means you can pay. You pay less, less and less. less in the future. Uh, but it's you know. Maybe you don't. You, you will. You will need. You will not need to pay anything in the future. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hopefully, our younger generation <laughs> don't worry about it. Yeah. When you grow older, there's no <laughs> any more kids that you need to give them red envelope. Yeah, yeah. So, so yeah. Don't worry about it. It will be a better world in the future. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And then I guess that's it. Yeah. So. So hope we, you guys enjoy both like a New Year, Western New Year, yeah, and, <laughs> and Lunar, Lunar New, New Year. Year. Lunar New Year is in like February. No, this first. year is in the last day of January. Oh, the end of January. Yeah, so so if one you guys, month later. If 
you guys would like to experience a new year, new years, welcome to Taiwan, and then you can have fun with us. That's it. The video for today. Happy New Happy Year's, new guys. Year. <laughs> 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 Bye.